Hello everyone, welcome back to Microsoft Word Tutorials Only. In today's video, we're going to alphabetize our glossary, meaning we're going to sort our definitions of glossary in alphabetical order. So for instance, let's say the word credit card is the definition that has the most earliest letter in the alphabet, I should say. I'm not really sure how to say that. But basically, we want to go A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K until we get to the end of the alphabet. If our glossary affords us to have all the definitions that are beginning with each letter in the alphabet. So instead of doing that manually, I'm going to show you guys how to do that in a second or two. Here on my YouTube channel, I only post Microsoft Word tutorials only here. You'll find it nowhere else but here in Microsoft Word tutorials only. So you'd want to subscribe and then you'd want to hit the notification bell so that every time I drop a new video, you'll be notified. And that is daily. Yes, I post videos each day. Now in our previous two videos, I used chat GPT for some reason saying that gives me a tongue twister, <laughs> but I used chat GPT to generate a glossary for us because as we know by now, Microsoft Word doesn't have a special feature to generate glossaries from our documents. And then I edited that glossary and now I told you that in a new video, I'll show you how to alphabetize that glossary. I'll link all those videos in the description below so you could look at those videos and you could do that for yourself. The first thing we'd want to do is select everything that we would like to alphabetize in our glossary. So I selected from the beginning of third world country to the last thing that says vlogs and then i'll go up to my ribbon menu here i'll ensure i'm on the home tab i'm there already if you're not there you could just click that and you come over here where it says a to z sort i'm gonna click that now there are several settings here that you could change if you want to right now we don't have to change anything because um we're not doing headings, we're doing paragraphs. And I'm not even sure what field one means right now, to be honest. But we'll just click paragraphs and then we'll go to text. We're not sorting numbers or dates, we're sorting text. And ascending and descending just simply means if you want to start from letter A or the last letter in the alphabet. So we want to start from letter A. And then we want to come down here. If I don't have a header row that I'm sorting, so I won't click that and then I'll click OK. Now for some reason, it took all the spaces or extra, the, uh, the spaces, the paragraph spacing that I had, it changed it. I'm not sure why that is. And it pushed it all the way to the bottom of the page. I think that that happened because of the formatting that I copied from ChatGPT came over with that so it's not a big deal all we have to do is click at the top of the page wherever we want our glossary to start and we hit delete and it will bring the glossary back up to the top if we want to go back in and put back that paragraph spacing we can just select it we could go up to paragraph and then we could click um, underlying spacing we could click 1.5 lines click ok and we're boom back to where we started remember guys i am on a goal to get to 1000 subscribers you subscribing here to youtube tutorials only will help me reach that goal and ensure you hit the notification bell beside the subscribe button so that you'll get a notification when i make a daily upload thanks for watching my video on how to alphabetize a glossary and i'll see you in tomorrow's video